Pleasures back to America and back to a Jehovah's Witness convention in Tulsa. We've been told we'd find a member of the governing body here. Ted Gerrits is one of the men responsible for the church's child protection policy. For more than two months, we've been asking them for an interview. We want answers to some simple questions. Why do they keep their database of suspected paedophiles secret? Why don't they report all allegations of abuse to the police? Why do they send children back to the arms of their abusers? They refused to talk to us, but here at last, we had our chance. How do you justify keeping a list of people, men in some cases, who have confessed to pedophilia, but you have not reported them to the authorities? What justification is there for you, you know, to keep that list? You have a privacy law. You have a directive from the European Union. You observe that, don't you? So when allegations well, of abuse are made, it's all right to keep them private? I think you were answered. That question was answered to your question to your satisfaction. Can you answer it now? I'm not going to repeat. I'll just tell you exactly that you can go and you see it if I do. It's all okay. You know, the Bible says, do not go beyond the things that are written. We don't go beyond the things that are written. And that was that. Let's move. Let's move this way. No doubt, no second thoughts. Just a simple belief that Jehovah will sort it out. A belief for which others, younger and more vulnerable, may continue to pay a price.